Hi everybody, it's Dennis Foster from Foster's Yacht Services, located at Lauderdale Marine Center. And this is going to be part of our May videos now that we're in May, which is a continuation of the project here on our engine removal from this 48-footer. So if you can see right over here and follow me down here, you can see we've de-dressed and disassembled the engine. Cooling system, exhaust, everything's off the engine. So really all that's left is the pan, the block, and the head. Now you see how skinny this engine is right now. It's a C18. Um, so when all the parts are reassembled on it, it becomes much more wider. So you can see now that we've de-dressed everything. We can pull it right through the hole, lift it up over here, and then we're going to, we took the door off. We're going to send it right out the back door with the forklift and the boom. If for some reason that doesn't go that way, I've already prepared the window that I took out the aft window here, and we'll then rearrange our A-frame with a nice curve and some I-beam sections, and we'll go right out the aft window. So this is all ready to come out now. Once this comes out, we'll get everything cleaned up. We'll prepare the bottom of the hole for the fiberglass work once the new engine goes back in. And again, the new engine, when it goes back in, has to look just like this. It's got to be de-dressed, disassembled, everything taken off so that it can fit in the space and then built back out. And if you also follow me here, if you look here, we've also cut the tent back there. So you can see how we cut the tent. So we get the forklift back in here with the long extension boom and get it right through that hole to lift up the engine and pull it straight out and set it on a pallet. The, all, the new engine's also in town, so that'll be brought over here. They'll disassemble the new engine at the shop from the uh, distributor, and then we'll drop that in, hook it up to the transmission, and then it'll be all what we call redressed. All the uh, parts will be reinstalled on there, then we'll close up the hole and start redoing the interior so it looks exactly like factory, brand new, as we got the boat. So, until that engine comes out, we start getting a little bit more progress for part of our May videos. Dennis Foster from Foster's Yacht Services on our 48-footer engine removal, signing out.